Hello, this is Katina Photography with my retouching page, The Lovely Retouch. Today, my tutorial is about creating collages or series. I've had several requests for such a tutorial, and so today I will show you. First off, you want to start off by opening a new file. You want it quite large, this one is 13 thousand pixels by thirteen thousand pixels 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 my apologies it's a late night I know some people may say it's over the top but if you wanna work with the largest format possible especially if you wanna keep all the detail that's how I do it and then I minimize for certain site parameters or printing parameters it just it keeps the detail for as long as possible you also want to open each and every one of your images that you want to include. These are mine from my photography. Okay, so the first step is to rectangle marquee. You want to select that. Select your image. Go to edit copy. Go to your new image. Edit paste. Now you're going to repeat this with each image. And that is pretty much it. I go through and delete all these. Makes the Photoshop run faster. And then you use the move tool and arrange them you please and how to do what I just did select right click and there you go it'll give you a little drop down menu so you know play around with that I like to take a couple minutes and see which order looks best I want a border around mine so It looks as though this one right here is just a bit tinier, so I think to balance it out, I'm gonna put it in the middle. Like that. Now you're gonna crop to your desired setup. Try to make it even. That's pretty big, so gonna put that down. Um, a lot of people ask me how I have to color the background and make it look nice. I usually go for an all white, but sometimes, you know, it's not what you want. So I'll just go with like a like a gray. And then you just, oh, background layer. Oopsie. Oh, I see what I'm doing here. Hang on. I'm having a brain fart. There you go. Background layer. Make sure that's selected so you don't do what I just did. And then I'll go and select a lighter shade here. And go to paintbrush. Make sure it's a large, large brush. 16% seems good. And then just go around the on the background layer around the images. Actually, I'm gonna have to turn that up just a little bit. And it gives kind of like a 3D look to the images, which looks pretty snazzy if you do it right if you take your time not do it as quick like I am and then I go through and then I'm 
might go through and make a slightly lighter color to just make this highlight just a little bit more. There you go. And then at the very end, you want to flatten your image. And there you go. You'll have to probably scale it down just a tinsy bit. And that's where you do it. I usually do percent because it keeps it even and proportion instead of trying to guess, you know. And that's pretty much it. That's how you make collages. It's pretty simple once you can figure it out. I'd also like to take the time to thank Amelia Hartford, the beautiful model in these photos. So, I hope you got something out of that. Feel free to comment and ask me any questions. I would gladly answer them. Have a nice day. As soon as I figure out what I'm doing here. It's not letting me close. Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, have a nice day. <laughs>